There isn't much left of Bakhmut to fight for, but Ukraine and Russia continue to throw soldiers and materiel into one of the bloodiest battles of the war in Ukraine. The head of Russia's Wagner mercenary group says his forces have taken control of the eastern part of the city. In a video released on Wednesday, Evgeny Prizhigin is shown talking to Wagner mercenaries who are complaining they're running out of ammunition. Wagner fighters have been leading the Russian campaign to seize Bakhmut. Prizhigin has accused Russia's defense minister, Sergei Shoigu, of treason for withholding supplies of munitions to his fighters. Munitions are in short supply too for Ukraine's forces. EU defense ministers have been meeting to discuss a plan for member states to pool resources to buy ammunition. NATO Secretary General says Bakhmut may fall to Russia in the coming days. This does uh, 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 not uh, necessarily uh, reflect any uh, turning point of the uh, war. Uh, and um, and, uh, and uh, uh, it just highlights that we should not underestimate uh, Russia. Uh, we must continue to provide support to uh, Ukraine. Ukraine's military released a video of a commander visiting troops in Bakhmut. Alexander Sierski tells the men they're in the hottest spot. Bakhmut is of little strategic value, but both the Ukrainian military and Wagner mercenaries have said they're using this battle to deplete and divert their adversaries' resources from elsewhere along the front line. Bernard Smith, Al Jazeera.